hello youtube and welcome to this video in this video i'm gonna show you how you can create rgb effects for your application inside the visual studio uh, and it will uh, and when once you know the trick uh, it will work for all the application and all the languages uh, even uh, if you want to do it in, inside the javascript or any other language it would work i'm gonna show you inside visual studio and on the windows form framework so I'm going to create a new project from that framework and click create So here is my application and we're gonna change the back color of this form. Perfect. So I'm gonna put it look good. And I have a default color to it which is gonna be red. So I'm gonna make it red. I have made it red. Now to its coding. So first of all, you need to create a timer here. So click the timer and go to the properties and click make this enable. When you make this enable, what happens is that when the application starts, the timer starts with it. So you don't have to press any button or do any anything to activate the timer. It would auto. Uh, it would auto start. So now click the timer again, and we're gonna go into the inside the tick event. Inside the tick event, we're gonna do all the stuff. So I'm gonna create three variable which would be called RGB and I am gonna create it outside the method outside the event and make this all zero except the R it would remain as 255 because I am starting with the value 255 as the red color so now here we're gonna do this dot background back color this uh, this means this form so this means the form so equals to we're gonna use a method color dot from argb and here we're gonna give our three variables so first is it's gonna make it red which is uh, it is already red so it won't make a difference and here we're gonna put up three condition which would make all the difference which would change the color so first let me write all the conditions first condition is I'm gonna copy this and paste it three times make it G B and I'm gonna press Ctrl K D and they are all arranged So now another condition to add from here. So B equal equals to zero and R equals to zero and G equal equals to zero. I
forget the end and in condition I'm gonna decrement the one which I which was the first so R here R here would be decremented and here G would be decremented and the last condition B would be decremented and inside here I will go like G plus plus and B plus plus and R plus <coughs> plus so what I have done is that I have made all the combinations so here R is with G and here G is with B and B with R so I have made all the combinations so this is the entire formula of the RGB uh, effects so it would change like this it will follow the uh, <clears throat> condition and change and the values would be changed according to this and then uh, next time the color would be applied so the timer would go on and on and on and change the color let's try it out so you can see here the color is changing slowly giving a beautiful effect you can change the color fast to increase it, its speed just go here timer and make this uh, as uh, let's say 400 Oh, it was 100 before so I'm gonna make it at 40 so now you can see the color is uh, changing fast and we can make it uh, uh, some more faster now you can see the color are changing very fast and very cool so this is it this is the formula for our RGB application you can remember it as R G B then R G is it, it start from here R G and then B and the one which is uh, on the first on the, the first condition it would decrement like this first condition it's decremented and as well as here and you can add another variable like G or B or R another variable here in the condition so this will form these three conditions which would make your RG effect uh, awesome. So thanks for watching this video. Press the like button if you like the video and do subscribe the channel for more hacks and more awesomeness. See you next time.